Hey Cancer, I hope y'all are doing well. Uh, this is gonna be your general reading for the next surprise coming towards you. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and jump right on into your reading here. I do have personals open for those of you who are interested. You can also check me out on Patreon if you'd like. That information is down below. Okay, so let's go ahead and start here for you. You got the Three of Pentacles as your overall energy. Right off the bat, I feel a lot of recognition here, a lot of fast movement towards something. Um, now, this could be fast movement towards you, but it feels like this is you desiring something and you just go for it, okay? It's like you are wasting no time here. Page of Wands to the Knight of Wands. It's like there's an idea, I'm putting it into action. Now, some of you could have a fire sign come in here, of course, but um, you know, it mainly feels like you're putting an idea into action. You feel drawn towards something. You feel a calling with judgment here. So yeah, you're moving towards that. What's going on with the Page of Wands for Cancer? Four of Wands, the Emperor, the Three of Pentacles, Seven of Swords Reverse, the Queen of Cups Upright, and the Three of Cups. Absolutely, you're getting so much attention here for a creation of yours. Um, you have the Emperor right here. This is, an, uh, this is an authority figure. It's a boss. This is somebody who has um, a lot of security or stability. Maybe you didn't have that before, but you're moving towards it, okay? Now, this could be that you're moving environments. The Four of Wands can often represent a home, but I feel like there's something to celebrate with friends and family. You have the three. This has been, yeah, I mean, this little thing has been buzzing. <laughs> every time I say something, you know, and I think it was in Gemini. Every time I said something, like, about a home, it was like, zzzz, you know. So, um, you could have some Gemini in your chart. But, yeah, uh, I feel like you're getting a lot of recognition here. And you have two three sh well, technically three threes showing up. So, yeah, that number could be significant to you, but it's also, you could be a life path three. Um, it also uh, symbolizes, like, uh, creation. It symbolizes expression. So, this could be you, um, you know, letting out some emotion. Uh, you know, expressing yourself through a creation of yours. So, yeah, you could be telling a story here of some sort. You could have some Leo or Sagittarius. Was it Sagittarius? Maybe Aries in your chart. Um, one of the fire signs got something similar when it comes to, you know, telling their story here. Um, we got the Knight of Wands showing up next. But the Seven of Swords in the reverse position, it's like you've got something here that you are letting out. Like you're putting it on display and people are loving it. What's going on with the Knight of Wands? Six of Swords, okay? Could be traveling for this. The Moon card, you've always felt hidden or maybe as if like, maybe as if your story or your voice didn't matter and I think that's changing here too, okay? Yeah, the High Priestess, you have felt very much behind the scenes. Three of Wands and now you're putting something out there. Three of Swords, yeah, you got two more threes showing up here, you guys. It's like, there's been a heartbreak here that you've experienced or there's something that's really difficult to go through that you are putting out there. People are relating to this. Um, people are relating to this. Some of you could be traveling to talk about this here. You have the judgment card showing up as well. Scorpio and Aries energy. This looks like it could be a slow moving journey here. Like this is something that is developing over the course of a few years is how it feels. Queen of Pentacles, the Sun card, the Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, absolutely getting a lot of exposure here. I feel like you're shocking people, you know, not just people, you know, that don't know you, but people who know you as well. It's like you are just in this space where you're going to be shocking with, like, people with your story here. What's going on with that? The Temperance card, okay? Um, the, what you've healed from is basically, like, you're, you're in such positive spirits after a really tough time, and everybody has a tough time. Everybody has a tough time. But it's like whatever you've gone through here is, like, triple that. Triple what most people go through. You've got so many cards of recognition, of just getting attention. I feel like you're just in a space where you are waking a lot of people up Okay, um, you're inspiring a lot of people here. You're going to be attracting new love because of this uh, story here. Like, you're just so, so very relatable is the energy that I feel here. And it's like you're not at the same time. It's like you have a very, very different story. But it's like people may look at you and think, well, if he or she can get through that, then I can get through this. You know, it's that kind of energy here that I feel you in. Yeah, you're just absolutely shocking the world here. Truly. So this is definitely for someone specific. I hope that you'll watch out for your other signs as well. Chariot, Victory, Four Movement. Yeah. I hope you watch out for your other signs as well, Cancer. Um, but I do hope that this was helpful. And uh, thank you so much for watching and supporting me this far. And you all enjoy your month. Bye.